hi and welcome to my maths class. Today we're doing a summary on inequalities. When we're doing inequalities, we need to know the basic rules. When we're doing the greater and less than with the equal to sign, then it is a square bracket. But when it has no equal to sign, then it is a round bracket. Also, infinity or negative infinity is going to be round brackets. When you're doing an inequality, you're going to try and get the factors exactly how you do a trinomial. But also, you need to know how to draw a parabola. Not draw it point by point, but know when it's a happy face or when it's a sad face. You don't tend to use the sad face a lot if you use the following rules. When you multiply or divide by a negative, the inequality sign changes. Now I prefer to always change it to be positive. So that if it's positive, I know this is the one graph I always need to know and I don't need to know the bottom graph. Now how do we do this? Let us take the following equation. Like a trinomial, you're going to get it all on one side. Then you're going to factorize Now at this level, we don't solve facts, we don't do this. This is not allowed. We do need those points, but that is not our answer. Now we know it's a positive graph. So we're going to have 1 and we're going to have minus 3. The question states I want greater than. Greater than means that the y part, because this is like your y, the y part is on top. So I'm talking of the positive y, meaning that our answer is from year till forever, infinity, and from year till infinity. Now how do we write it? Write it exactly as you're seeing it. You see negative infinity is first and then negative 3. And then we have 1 and infinity. The reason you have two answers is because the two lines are not touching each other. Now how do I decide if they're round or square brackets? Infinities are always round, but this has an underline and equal to sign. So it is a square bracket. Let us do the same sum, but we're going to do the question as follows. So we have x squared plus 2x minus 3 is less or equal to 0. Now because it's less, I'm working with the same drawing. I'm on minus 3 and I am on 1, but less than is the bottom part. So what would my answer be? Because the line is touching, it is only one answer. And you are again reading it as you are seeing it, minus 3 to 1. Round or square brackets, square brackets, because I have an underline. So when it is one line, then I am going to have one answer. But when it's two separate lines, I'm going to have two separate answers. Thank you for watching.